yesterday our community, several of our community leaders met to discuss uh, social distancing and, and some of those things that you've heard about on the media in terms of stay at home. We are currently continuing that discussion, um, but at this point we are not doing a shelter or a stay at home. However, we are uh, considering it and we're watching what the community does. We would really like to see our community take the responsibility to implement the public health orders that have already been issued from the, from the governor in terms of distancing, minimizing social contact, minimizing your trips and your other shopping needs, those kind of things to stores, um, staying home if you're sick, and following those guidelines, um, which we think will really help to uh, slow down the curve, um, slow down the spread of this virus in our community. Um, we did have a long discussion yesterday uh, in uh, the three uh, commissioners. Uh, we are staying in close contact uh, with other elected officials, including the mayor and his office. And at this particular time, we feel like the measures that we have in place right now are adequate for the circumstances and what we're facing. Uh, even if you look at the uh, stay uh, in place that they have in uh, the city of Denver, there's a lot of exceptions to it, including things like construction and liquor stores, and, uh, marijuana dispensaries and things like that. Uh, we think that we have, uh, as this thing has progressed, we've taken steps uh, along the way uh, that uh, we felt were it needed that particular time. Uh, we're gonna continue to talk with the city. Uh, we're gonna continue to uh, take advice from uh, the uh, people who are getting the information from the statewide level, and we are gonna continue to uh, act in the best interest of the people of Pueblo. I also would like to say, I'd like to thank the people on the front line, uh, people like uh, Mr. Ebbett and his people at the at the city county health uh, facility, as well as the sheriff's department, uh, and all those people out there continuing to work and provide us with the services that we need. Um, it makes this just a little bit easier, but people can use common sense during this process. If you have a fever, don't go.